Pirates of the Caribbean, The Curse of the Black Pearl, Q by Q Breakdown. Due to copyright reasons, the full Q won't be played, but rather highlights showcasing the different themes and ideas. Check out my previous video on the theme names and letters that I referred to, and note that composers are unconfirmed for each Q. With that, grab your bottle of rum and let's dive in. 3M21, Black Pearl Arrives, scored by James Dooley. Opens with the pan flute, then we get those clave clicks again. With the arrival of the pearl, we get an open to stopped horn sound, making things a bit tense. <laughs> 3M22, Sacking the Village, scored by James McKee Smith, opens with the lay so motif. Then we get a mixture of the Leso Do theme, theme O, and theme N. For the majority of the music when in the governor's house, we get variations on the N theme. <music> 3M22A, Elizabeth Hides, scored by Claus Battelt, is a musical insert for when Elizabeth is in the closet. Musically, we get some laso size and then the pan flute in a very low octave. 3M23, Sacking the Village, scored by Claus Battelt, starts with the theme and variation we got from 3M22. There's a quick quote of Barbosa's theme and a lay so to end the cue. M24, You Know Nothing of Hell, Elizabeth Meets Barbosa. Scored by Blake Neely, this has plenty more Leso motifs. Another occurrence of the Moonlight Serenade motif. And the pan flute. Theme A plays in Barbosa as well as part of theme O. We get our first of two occurrences of the Turner motif. Turner. Then a version of theme N. When we see Will, we get some of the love theme. Three M twenty five, boarding the Dauntless, scored by Ramin Javadi, starts with a variation of the Legends theme. Not sure if this was the best use of it. We then get our escape plotting theme. Three M twenty six, commandeering the Interceptor, scored by James Dooley. After Norrington mentions Jack is the worst pirate he's ever seen, we get Jack's theme. The escape theme plays when Jack and Will take off on the Interceptor, and I feel like Barbosa's theme is hinted at as well before the B section of the escape theme. When Jack is mentioned again, we get his theme that plays for the rest of the queue. M27, Under the Command of a Pirate, scored by James Dooley. This is a transition cue, starting with Barbosa's theme before going into unique transition material. Two, 
3M28, Pirate's Musk, composed by Craig Eastman, which I guess would make a tenth composer working on this film, is the theme for Tortuga. This is the only cue where it appears, and is the only cue scored by Craig as well. 4M29, I'm going after the Black Pearl. Scored by Blake Neely, starts out with Barbosa's theme, Then a variation on theme O. Since this came after the line about finding a crew, maybe theme O is a pirate crew theme. Mentioning Will is the son of Bootstrap, we get the second and final occurrence of the Turner motif. The cue closes with some Leso Do and Moonlight Serenade rhythms. M30, The Captain's Table. Scored by James Dooley, opens with a variation on the Leso theme, and then we get a ton of Leso. Really short cue. For M31, Story of the Medallion, scored by Steve Jablonski. This cue opens with the longest version Barbosa's theme in the movie. During the second time through Barbosa's theme, we get the claves again. After this, there is a rhythmic building on Barbosa's theme. This rhythm is then transformed into a Phrygian mode, almost like a danger version of Barbosa's theme. To close out, we get more Leso Do and a transition into the Moonlight Serenade. M32, Moonlight Serenade, is scored by Jeff Zanelli and is just the two Moonlight Serenade themes played throughout. m 33 You Best Start Believin', is scored by Jeff Zanelli. It starts with theme N. followed by a slow version of the first Moonlight Serenade theme, and closes with Lay So. What are you looking at? Back to work. 4M34, We're Catching Up, scored by Blake Neely, is mostly a self-contained cue, but the music does share some qualities to theme N, and similar rhythms to several themes as well. It ends with the lay so on Elizabeth. Four M thirty-five is scored by Jeff Zanelli. Starts with Barbosa's theme and lay so. When the scene transitions, we get the pan flute and lay so do theme. How is it that Jack can buy that compass? Not a lot of Four M thirty six, Jack's Legend, scored by Ramin Javadi, starts with a variation of the Legends theme and theme N mixed with Barbosa's theme with a lay so thrown in there. M37, The Grotto, scored by James Dooley, has theme N, clave clicks, and the pan flute. 